today's video is what I eat in a day. How I'm eating, what I'm doing to stay healthy and fit during the weekend. The weekends used to be my downfall. <laughs> on a weekend. The weekends used to be my downfall. I would make really healthy choices throughout the week, but for some reason on the weekend, the wheels would just fall off. Everything would just totally turn to custard and Monday would arrive. And on Monday, the scales would be way up. I'd be feeling bloated. I'd be feeling gross. And I just couldn't make any progress because I kept getting stuck in this cycle of the weekends undermining my progress. But the truth is that weekends can be healthy, delicious, Fun. You don't have to feel deprived and that is key because if you hate what you're eating and you feel like you're missing out You won't want to continue with that lifestyle and it is all about making a healthy lifestyle change Because when you do that you stay consistent and the consistency is what gets you to your results Because it takes some time to lose weight to see the changes that you want to feel healthier to get healthier And you need to allow your body some time for those changes to take place. And if every single weekend you find that you're getting derailed, then it might be time to reassess and look at what you could do differently so that when Monday does come around, you're just continuing to move forward. I'll be sharing the recipes that I'm making, the foods that I'm eating, and exactly how I keep moving towards my goals. for cafes that cater to your dietary requirements or are happy for you to make customizations to their menu. Hi, can I please get two of the keto BLTs? One with chicken. to come to this exact shopping village every weekend would you say pretty much yeah because there was this chinese takeaway that we loved and i just asked dave what was our order our order was chicken and sweet corn soup for al wonton soup for me then we had uh, mapo tofu japanese with rice chicken with rice both with rice combination fried noodles for two people a lot of food. and then while we waited we'd shoot across to the market and grab a tub of ice cream our weekends have changed so much. so convenient using a pre-made salad mix. Whenever I use them, I always take out any little add-ins that are higher in carbs just because I follow a keto lifestyle. And I always make sure that I take out the dressing because these normally are super high in sugar and it's so easy to make your own.
This afternoon has been so fun. My sister and her boyfriend came over with their puppy, Starbuck. So Charlie got to play with him, which was so cute. I normally always have a keto-friendly treat in my fridge or my freezer, which is perfect for when guests stop over, like my sister and her boyfriend. Today we had these amazing mocha brownies. The recipe for these are on my Instagram, so go and check them out. Mm, this is really good. Mm, Thank this you. This is amazing. And it's so important to continue to drink water throughout the day, which is exactly what I was sipping on with our guests here. And then for the rest of the afternoon, I have been tidying up. I need to make dinner. Tonight for dinner, we are going to have chili cheese fries. On the weekend, we like to have something called, we call fakeaways, which are basically just like comforting foods that we have on the weekend. Normally they're takeaway inspired, so we can have even any kind of cuisine, but I'm feeling like chili cheese fries tonight. And on the note of having comforting foods on the weekend, I made some yummy ice cream bars. They are strawberry frozen yogurt bars. I'm gonna coat them with chocolate because why not? It's foods like these that keep me on track over the weekend. If you find that you're falling off the wagon and you're making choices that you're regretting later, try making a healthier version at home that you have on hand that you can pick instead of reaching for the things that you used to eat. As you saw today, Dave and I, we walked by an old stomping ground of ours. We used to eat so much Chinese food, get ice cream, get junk food, all of that stuff. And literally just by making those changes to our lifestyle, not having those foods every weekend like we were doing, has been a massive change. You can still enjoy takeaways and your favorite junk food every now and again, absolutely. And that can totally form part of your healthy lifestyle. But if you're eating that all the time every weekend that can have a seriously negative impact on your overall progress the easiest way to reach your goals is to find a lifestyle that you enjoy that you can stick with and that you can sustain even on the weekends and that is why I make the kinds of foods that I do because it's delicious keeps us on track we just love it we'd eat it regardless something I do like to do is have a sparkling water as I make dinner because it's yummy and it helps stop me from snacking as well as I'm making dinner I am the worst for snacking as I'm making dinner and I find that this is the best thing to stop that <laughs> Free gin and tonic or a gin gin and tonic? Gin gin. Oh. Saturday night. Whoa. ginless gin and tonic. I'm using this non alcoholic spirit by Seedlip. Yours is more herbaceous. If oh I'm yeah, and yeah. yours is more like I'll have a sip of yours. Yours is really like herby. Oh yeah. Tastes like it's pretty close though, I reckon. You've like just broken like a sprig of, spr of herbs. We love The Office. So good that it's on Netflix. Have our gins and tonics. Real gin, not real gin, but yum. The side the veggie sides that I made. It's just frozen veggies that I cooked in the oven. They're so yummy. I just feel like having some veggies with our chili cheese fries and pork rinds to dip in. It's now time for dessert and then we're gonna watch some more office and head to bed pretty soon because tomorrow we have another workout booked. Just cause it's the weekend, we don't stop. We keep up with our regular lifestyle. Excuse me, I'm trying to talk to my friends. Okay. Just give me a second. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one. Kakitana. Bye.